Hi all. Uh, hi all. Today we are going to discuss about uh, very important topic uh, ethics. Hi everyone. Today we are going to discuss about very important topic uh, ethics. So what is ethics? It's a code of moral standards of conduct for what is good and right as opposed to what is bad or wrong. So what do you mean by ethics? It's a simple term. What is right? What is wrong? So what are the things covered under the ethics? Rules and regulations, values, research, moral principles, ethical practices, rules of conduct. So these are the things covered under that ethics. So for example, if you see every human being, you must follow the rules and regulations. For example, in a signal, it will be green, you can go. It will be red, you can stop, right? Same like that, values, research, and moral principles. So next we are going to discuss about business ethics. The same thing we are doing in the business ethics also. So what are the things covered under that behavior, principle, trust, responsibility, relationship, reliability, choice, morality. So these are the things covered under that business ethics. So what is business ethics? Business ethics can be defined as written and unwritten codes of principles and values that govern decisions and actions within a company. So in the business world, the organization culture sets standards for determining the difference between good and bad decision-making behavior. So in every organization, we are having some rules and regulation that is written and unwritten codes. So the employee, you must follow the moral ethics. So definition of business ethics, according to Andrew Crum, Business ethics is the study of business situations, activities, and decisions where issues of right and wrong are addressed. So next we are going to discuss about nature of business ethics, code of conduct. Code of conduct, everyone know in an organization. So everyone following the code of conduct is very, very important. In business ethics, is a code of conduct. It tells that what to do and what not to do for the welfare of the society. All businessmen must follow this code of conduct. Next, we are going to see that based on moral and social values. Business ethics is based on moral and social values. It contains moral and social principles that rules for doing the business. So every businessman includes self-control, consumer protection and welfare, service to society, Fair treatment to social groups, not to exploit others. That's a very important. Not to exploit others. Gives protection to social groups. Business ethics give protection to different social groups such as consumers, employees, small businessmen, government, shareholders, creditors, etc. Provides basic framework. Business ethics provide a basic framework for doing business. It gives the socio-cultural economic, legal, and other limits of business. Business must be conducted within these limits. Voluntary. Business ethics must be voluntary. The businessman must accept business ethics on their own. It's voluntary is nothing but self-discipline. So every human being, they are having self-discipline, self-control. So it must not be enforced by law. That case, education and guidance. Businessman must be given proper education and guidance before introducing business ethics. So relative term, business ethics is a relative term. That is, it changes from one business to another. It also changes from one country to another. If you see, if you're doing a business in India, there is a rules and regulation culture. It will be the different. If you compare to that abroad, that place, for example, whether it is a US or UK or Australia, their culture, their ethics, their moral principles, so everything it will be different. So new concept, business ethics is a newer concept. 
it's strictly followed only in developed countries it's not followed properly in poor and developing countries thank you all